good morning everyone how are you all doing today today is day eight of our meditation series I am excited about today because I'm just gonna keep it really short we're gonna do it simple today just because I have to go teach a class <laughs> so what I wanted to talk about today is how sometimes we, I forgot what I wanted to talk about. <laughs> I just, I just woke up. So, <laughs> give me a second. Okay, I'm ready now. So today I wanted to talk about faith and how when we are diving into anything, anything we want to create, anything we want to work on in our lives, or we are working through something, we have to have faith in the universe or source or God or whatever label you want to put there. We have to fit faith in. Um to help us manifest or create the desired outcome that we are wanting. And sometimes, um, and I'm talking from personal experience, we work really hard onto something, into something, onto, into, in, on something, and we work really, really hard and then the outcome that we're expecting, wishing, is not coming as quickly as we had hoped. And so sometimes we tend to get down really quickly and we tend to, yeah, for kind of like our energy lowers, we get down, we don't feel as motivated anymore. And the thing is, when that happens, actually what, we, what needs to happen is to trust and have faith. Because really, the universe has got your back. And the universe knows what you want. However, at the moment that you are wishing it to happen, it might not be the right timing for you. Right? So sometimes other things need to happen for your outcome to actually come true. Some things that you might not even have control over things that you might not even have i don't know like um it could be other people's responsibility to finish something it could be um two people have to meet in order for the ripple effect to happen for you and those people haven't met yet there's so many factors that go into a situation coming true that actually really it's it has nothing to do with you because you are taking the steps to get there the only thing is that when we don't receive the results as quickly as we'd hoped we take that as a sign that it's not meant to happen and sometimes it is but most of the time it's not and we just need to push through and keep going or change something slightly so that we can keep going and then the results start coming in and so today our meditation is going to be focused around having faith and so we're just going to sit in our meditate meditation seat and we are going to connect with source god the universe whatever and it might sound strange but really it's all about connecting to your heart connecting to your heart and letting your heart speak to you that's 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 the key that's the way it is that's how it works <clears throat> your connection to whatever name you want to give to the exterior bigger powers there are in the universe they connect to your heart so we are going to sit in meditation 
and we are going to connect to our hearts and then we're going to ask our hearts if our hearts have anything to tell us today that's all we're going to do and then at any point if your mind starts to take over and thoughts start to come and take you away from this moment come back through breathing come back to sitting right here in the moment because that's what we're training we're training discipline here we're training practice right we're training we're training practice those same words we're training the fact that we are coming back to the present moment we're coming back over and over and over and over again and at one point you will receive an answer and at one point you will hear it and at one point you will actually believe it and at another point you're gonna feel it inside of your body and then at the next point you're actually gonna live it so it takes time but you're gonna get there and it's gonna feel beautiful so I'm gonna give you a minute to grab the things you need your journal a seat water whatever you need I am gonna set my timer and re tweedle my seat tweedle I am I'm still waking up I'm still waking up oh good Okay, so let's grab a comfortable seat. Let's close our eyes. You can find a drishti gaze point if that doesn't feel comfortable to close your eyes. And I encourage you to have a point that doesn't move so that you can turn internally and listen to what's inside. So we're gonna close our eyes. I'm going to take three deep breaths together, taking one deep inhale, exhale, let it go, one more deep inhale, and release, and last one deep inhale. And slowly let go. Good. So sitting here, taking this moment to just land, feeling yourself completely sitting down onto the floor. Feeling yourself connecting with the earth. Noticing your energy land. Relax your jaw. Relax your shoulders. And feel yourself getting heavier with every breath that you take. When you're ready, you can gently make your way to your heart center. So just bringing your awareness to your heart, just feeling around your heart.
open yourself to listening to what your heart has to say. And gently open the space up for your heart to tell you anything you need to hear today. If at any point your mind starts to take over and takes you away from this present moment, gently come back by using your breath. And at the end of the 10 minutes, I will let you know when we are done and we'll slowly come out of the meditation together.
Taking a deep inhale, filling your entire lungs with air. Exhale, let it go. Slowly start to wiggle your fingers and your toes, bringing soft movement back into your body. Give yourself a nice big stretch. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really encourage you to write anything down in your journal that came up. Sometimes it takes us to sit in silence for us to hear what our hearts and the universe actually wants us to hear. We can spend so much time thinking about all the things that we have to do and thinking about all the things that we want to create that we actually don't make space for what we should be doing, should be doing, and make space for what we actually desire in our hearts. And sometimes we make excuses or we think of other things to do instead of what we actually want to do. So we don't actually do the things that we want to do. Does that make sense? Yeah. <laughs> So journal about what came out if you heard anything through your heart space today. If you didn't hear anything, that's okay. You know, that's part of the learning curve. And if your mind really took you out and you spent most of meditation somewhere else, that's also okay. This is part of the practice to always come back using your breath to always come back into your seat and just sit here with yourself so take some time to process through what you heard and what you didn't hear if that was the case just journal about so that you can get all of that emotion outside of your body thank you for joining me today on day eight and i will see you all tomorrow for day nine have a beautiful day